New at 11, many present at Mingo Junction Council tonight with concerns over a possible safety risk. News 9's Ed DiOrio spoke with those worried about what had them in front of village officials. Logan Avenue and surrounding areas in Mingo Junction has fallen victim to natural occurrences like landslides in the past. But one property owner's possible action could increase the chances of those things happening even more. That's why residents of Logan Avenue and around that area came to Mingo Junction Village Council to voice their concerns. My initial thought was, oh no, the hillside. If they strip the trees, strip the topsoil, then what we have is a waterfall coming down to our house, which isn't designed for that. For a few years, there's been word that trees and topsoil could be removed by property owners from a hillside around Logan Avenue, which could increase the risk for landslides and water runoff. The area potentially at risk has multiple homes, sidewalks, a road, and playground at the landing point of natural debris. Many coming forward to voice their concern Tuesday night. We need to know what is going to happen that protects their homes and eventually that our children and other neighbors who walk and play along the street are safe. Well, I wish the owner would come forward and, and, and belay our fears, you know. The land at the center of the possible issue is privately owned. So while council is aware of the worries from its residents, their hands are tied. But that doesn't mean they won't do what they can to make sure it's safe for the area as a whole. A person owns private property like that, we can't go in there and say, oh, you can't cut trees down. But your concerns are concerned, so they're going to have to come to us eventually. And them concerns you're giving us, we're going to throw them back at them and see what kind of answers they give us. But we will do everything in our power to make sure that everything is done correctly. Council members and residents alike on the evening were both hoping that the property owners come forward to Village Council to cooperate and see what can be done about the situation. Reporting in Mingo Junction, I'm Ed DiOrio for News 9.